So uh, wouldn't I know is a tough question to answer because I always hoped and had it in my mind that I was going to make it, even though everybody else told me it was impossible. In my mind, I told myself that I was going to make it, and I did everything in my power to make it. But there was a time when I was, uh, I was a sophomore in high school, and my high school coach, Ryan Mullaney, uh, had me and actually my two older brothers, who were very good athletes as well, stand up and, uh, and asked us or told us that we are the only people in the room that had a legitimate chance to make it to the NFL. Now, he actually played in the NFL for uh, a couple of uh, training camps. His brother actually was an eight-time All-Pro, and uh, his name was Mark Mullaney for the Minnesota Vikings. And so I kind of I had a feeling that he knew what he was talking about. So when he told me that, you know, I, it was, it was uh, very uplifting for me because it gave me that confidence that I actually could do it if I worked hard enough. But then even when I got to college, I went to the University of Miami, and all my friends told me Miami was a bad choice because they were very good. And coming from Denver, Colorado, not many people make it to the NFL. So going to Miami was a, it was a tough choice because, you know, I didn't know if I was going to play or if I was going to just ride the bench all, for, all my four years there. But when I got there and having some of the other D linemen laugh at me because I was so skinny being 6'8", I was only 220 pounds. You know, being 6'8", 220 is, is very skinny. So I had to tell myself that I was going to work hard and get to where I needed to be to be great. So I, I put on a lot of weight, got up to 265, a pure muscle, and I became a great player at the University of Miami. And, uh, and I was actually uh, the MVP of the team my redshirt sophomore year. And I had my name on the, on the same wall as, you know, Ray Lewis or Ed Reed or Michael Irvin and some of the great players are in the Hall of Fame that will be in the Hall of Fame. So for me, that was very lifting. But I, I knew when I was the MVP of the team at the University of Miami and put my name next to those Hall of Famers that I could be a great player, not only an NFL player, but a great NFL player.